Hi guys, and welcome to the last part of problem 4.9, where we assume that m is Poisson distributed with parameter lambda. In this case, we're asked to show that then the variance of n, the zero modified version, is strictly greater than the expected value. So let's do that. Um, just draw a line down here, so we'll do that down here. So assume that m you know what, maybe I should change the color because I wrote the above with, yeah, so, so assume that M is Poisson distributed with parameter lambda. Then show that the variance of N is greater than the mean of n, where n is the zero modified version, so n is equal to i multiplied by m, where i is defined as we had earlier. Now, uh, we have some results from earlier, right, that tells us that the mean of n is equal to the success probability of i multiplied by the mean of m. And we also know that the variance of n So we know from A that this and the variance of N is given by P multiplied by the variance of M plus the square of the mean, so the mean value of M squared multiplied by P multiplied by 1 minus P. Now let's just try to recall, when m is Poisson distributed, what does that mean? Well, for a Poisson distributed random variable, the mean of that variable is equal to the parameter, and the mean and the variance of that variable is also equal to the parameter lambda. So this means that the mean of n is equal to p multiplied by lambda, whereas the variance of n is equal to p multiplied by lambda plus lambda squared p1 minus p. So what we notice is the difference between the variance of n and the mean of n is that the variance of n is equal to the mean of n plus something that's greater than zero. So hence the variance of n is greater than the mean of n. So quite quickly, we are done with this exercise.